morning guys hey it's a book day we already emptied that one tossed them to that one so look at you can see this thing was full that thing's almost full so this is kind of again what we end up with here's a cool set right here look at that louis lamore right louis lamore a bunch of books not sure about that bible uh some very unique flash cards that's kind of interesting more louis lamore if you watched commonwealth picker he had some louis lamore uh books so now i found something interesting over here some more books some interesting software uh art of explosion you know that's gonna give me something it's all in there and we got to go over here because we've got a few more a few more you know, some books in here we got to go through and some books in here we got to go through so basically uh all this stuff today i paid 140 140 for all this and i should be do pretty good so hey we'll get back to you in a little bit wow all right everyone hey i just took a break it is now just to give you an idea bins started at nine it's now 11 30 and i showed you the first part of the video i'm going to take you back kind of show you where i'm at what a mess i got and you want to sell books on amazon fba this is kind of what you got to go through so it's not all glamour you know you see some of these videos cut up and it's like wow making a lot of money uh, i'm going to give you the truth right here this is the truth <laughs> Today was wild, and today's Senior Tuesday, so it's, I'm not even, I don't know when I'm gonna get there. So, you deal with what you have in front of you. That's what you deal with. You set your routine, and then if the routine gets broke, that's okay. You just kinda have to maybe skip a step or go forward into the next one. So I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I know that I'm gonna have some of my iced tea, some of my iced tea video. Yeah, I always bring that with me. One thing you gotta do, you gotta bring something to drink here. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's gonna get hot where I'm at with these books, and I'm 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 older, and it's gonna get me. But anyhow, don't be fooled. So just I'm trying to really give you a good visualization of just kind of if you're a one man show, like I'm a one man show all the way around. I package, ship, list, everything, FBA, eBay, uh, Facebook Marketplace. It's me. And uh, I hustle it out. I hustle hard. So this is what you kind of got to do uh, to make good money. Now, you know, you've heard me talk about it before. I've got a year and a half, two-year plan. That's why I'm pushing so hard. Uh, but uh, it's fun. I will tell you that. It's still fun. It's, you don't have any boss. Uh, you get to do what you want to do. You get to see a lot of cool things. You get to see some books. I'm going to show you a set of books in there. I'll tell you when I want to get to them how amazing that those set of books are to me personally. To me personally. So I'm going to show you some books that Commonwealth Picker got the other day. And now I got some. We're going to show you a little bit of everything. We'll see what we come up with for the rest of the day. Who knows? If not, we're going to cut it short to show you some uh, things that sold. But we'll, we'll take a look and see what we can come up with other stores. We're going to definitely get out and still thrift. So all right, I'm going to flip this around when I get out. We're going to go take a look and see what we got going. All right, guys, here it is. I have not cleaned up yet, so we're gonna just go around. Anything you see like in this kind of a bin or a box, that's going straight to Amazon. So that's a full Amazon right there. Everything else in here needs to kind of be looked at, except for something like Louis L'Amour, that's gonna be a lot of. But you can see, I started with one of these and then two C carts, which were these big carts. And today I spent $140 and had to move so I moved this entire bin here into this entire bin. So that's how many books, this is, a, this is the rejects. That's how many you reject out, just a ton. So anyhow, here we got Louis L'Amour a lot. I don't know what we'll get, but we'll, we'll lock that up. Down here, we got some cool flashcards. There's three sets, the spinal nerves, the muscles, and the bones, interesting. These just need to kind of be looked up on a ISBN basis. They didn't have a UPC code. Uh, same thing. These need to be kind of looked up a little bit here. Uh, this is an interesting older set. Some of these older box sets, especially Ballantine, the B, you can really make some good money. So uh, we will look that one up. We'll look up Elmo's World, see what we can get for that. Now here's the interesting one. You know, when you... 
when you hit something like this the tripods trilogy uh, that's an amazing book to me that book there it's a trilogy that was as a kid my favorite books so i'm gonna read these i'm gonna read these this is so cool uh i didn't check them up to see what they're worth i don't care uh i can read these probably in a couple of days amazing books to me john christopher so every so often when you do these bins you find something that uh you know re you relate to and i relate to this book set very very cool and i hear the gilmore girls very interesting dvd set and it's kind of like set up like a book booklets or something and all the dvds are in there have no idea of the value but we will find out obviously all these dvds they were all in there um this i'm having a garage sale this weekend so these are all going to go to garage sale great dollar a pop right whatever um so over here some more you know uh, song books here we go these are the louis lamore uh books this is the one that kevin the commonwealth picker he he showed uh it just it would have caught my eye but you know kevin just kind of alerted me again to it you know that kind of thing uh, right there, some uh, Dr. Seuss type books. There's another box of Amazon. Some more books I got to look at. There's that software. So, anyhow, this is what you got to do, folks. Oh, yeah, a pair of shoes, too. I haven't even looked up those shoes yet. I have no clue. <laughs> if it's worth something, I'll flash it across there. But there it is, guys. That's what you got to do. All right. All right, we'll be back. See you in a bit. All right, guys. Hey, we loaded it up. There it is. There it is. It's all in here. One last look. This Bible, I looked it up. It's got a comp of $69 recently. No writing in it. Uh, easy. I got to say 50 bucks. Easy on that. I even found a pair of shoes. Check those out, huh? Mephisto's. I think I'm going to get about 35 to $50 on those. <laughs> Just a pair. They were in the bins, man. <laughs> wild dvds for the garage sale and just a ton a ton of books including the louis lamore all right guys on to savers to see what we can conquer there see you there all right everybody in it savers i wasn't feeling it i was kind of like exhausted after all those books but anyhow uh, i did pick up three items two of them are gonna go combined with what i bought from them yesterday these must have come out uh, obviously today, but I really needed one of them to help complete one of my other um, uh, sets. And I'll show you what it is in a second. So, you know, this is uh, all about hustle today. Today's going to be one of them days where I'm just going to have to keep going. So I'm going to head up next to the Goodwills, do a few of those, and then just play it out. Uh, I got a ton of stuff to uh, to do, so I kind of need a break. So I'm kind of I'm not I'm not wishing I don't find anything. But I'm like, please, please make it easy today. All right, we'll flip this around and we'll uh, we'll look at the items real quick. Okay, here they are. If you saw the video the day, the two days ago or whatever, I got another Mel Science. This one's called Corrosion. What Mel Science is? It is a subscription-based type service uh, from a while ago. So you get these kits, right? And this is 12 plus. I think it's 12. 12th grade plus or 12 plus I, I i'm not positive 12 years old plus i think but anyhow this is the one i needed the starter kit i've never found the starter kit now it's open but everything's in the starter kit so i won't open it but everything's in there so that makes my lot even a little better now so i'm gonna go pull my ad off ebay reshoot and put it back up these are gold all the time. Brother, 3TN, 350, 399. These guys, uh, you got to get them sealed because these uh, the ink resellers are very, very picky. So it's not a whole lot. It's probably about $34, and you got to include shipping. But you do make quick money. They, they sell pretty darn fast. All right, so that's it from Savers. Not a lot. Off we go to the next uh, location. Right, let's start out with a tennis racket. Here we go. All right. Early on, I was catching a lot of tennis rackets, many tennis rackets, and I uh, had some good success with them. 
then it kind of dried up. I don't know if it was COVID or what, but just dried up. Nobody was donating really, really good ones. Found a decent one today. It was $7. It's a Wilson Burn 100 LS. Again, it's like golf clubs. When you, you, you feel that grip and you feel this one, you kind of know this one's got a little value. This is $50 to $59. Nothing tremendous, but it's, it, it has comps. That's what I look for in all these things, right? It's comps. So this should sell pretty quickly. All right. Savers find old school electronics, Radio Shack. This is a uh, five way tilting audio, auto sensing stereo AV selector. Wow, that's a lot to say. VCR, satellite, DVD, game, auxiliary. This will go into Amazon. $4.99. It's going to be at least $49 in Amazon. It will sell quickly. It's a sales rank of $3,200. So it should sell pretty quick, all right? Up next, VHS to DVD, uh, 359, a Goodwill find. Um, this is like old software again, right? This is a good one, VHS to DVD. So it's all in one. Uh, this is $30 easily. So this would be 30 bucks here. So I'll take that all day long, all right? Found another one of these. Right. This one here is the Atlas Mercato uh, Wellness 150. Atlas Mercato Wellness 150. It is I paid 919. It is brand new in the box, so they don't garner a whole lot. Used to be able to sell these on Amazon, but dear old Amazon decided that hey, or Mercata Mercato decided to. Uh, make it a requirement that you uh send in some paperwork basically that's not that's being gated basically is what's happening it was not gated then all of a sudden the gate was shut down and i'm not too sure why but you would have got about 100 to 125 on amazon but amazon's now on it for about 89 and uh, that might be part of the reason they might have cut a deal who knows so anyhow this now uh gets about 69 to 79 and you'll get some shipping on it. So you'll get $69.79. So quick flip, it's still worth picking up. All right, we're gonna get into some other interesting stuff. A few more items. Gotta, gotta open it. Like the zipper's jams. That figures, right? Right when you're doing a video, the zipper jams. Not prepared, not prepared. Take the pieces out one by one. I don't edit these very well either, so. All right, there it is, the Canon. This is the EOS and this is the XTI. I believe there's an XT. The I is the more expensive one. This is a 10 megapixel. There's one, two lenses, that one, and then, also the power cord for uh, this one. So I got all three. That's the big key here is, is all three of those. This is gonna get me about $299. And I paid, there it is, I think $14.99, $14.99. Thought the bag was good, now it doesn't look like the bag's good. I think that's the cable. I don't even know if that's the charging kit, whatever. It's in the bag. <laughs> I might go to my Sony that I'm gonna show you next. There you go, Canon. All right, up next. Yeah, I should have had all these open, right? <laughs> Not doing too good today. All right, I got it, I got it. All right, the Sony Handycam. We've seen me pick these up all the time. This is one that has, it has night shot, I think. And yeah, night shot, night shot and steady shot. Uh, I have the power cords to these so I can test it. If it tests out, it's 100 to 149 in that range, okay? Uh, I have the tapes, all that kind of stuff. So I can test this one. If it works, we've got some money in it. If not, we still sell it for parts. Uh, I did pay uh, $12.99 for it. Even for parts, it'd probably be worth 40 bucks. So we'll go from there. 
those are always good. Sony's always the good name. Matter of fact, we have one more Sony and the camera is bouncing. Here we go. It's heavy. What's up? It's heavy, guys. It must be an amplifier. There it is. The old Sony amplifier. This one here is the, oh my gosh, I forgot what it was. <laughs> oh, uh, STR 6050. STR 6050. Very, very, very nice. Vintage one. Uh, paid there's a price. I think I paid $19.99 minus 20%. Anyhow, the um, the uh, uh, deal about this is this is not that expensive of a receiver on the resale market. It will only sell for about at best 200, so right around 200 bucks. That's what the best price for that will be. So uh, there you go. Those are the hauls. That's the haul for today, and uh, you know we we did good. If you add up the total value, we did really well. I didn't kill it out there as far as uh, numbers, total numbers. But anyhow, that's what uh, we got today for the, the for the haul site. And what we're going to do is flip this around and we'll look at what sold. All right, guys, we're back to show you what sold. We'll give you every time we try to do a video, we'll try and give you a few items that sold. First up is the kitchen fair pot. If you saw one of my flea market videos, we picked this up at the flea market. We paid $20 for this pot. Wish I would have got a little bit more, but hey, eh, you know, I moved it. I made good money. Sold for $120 with $24.95 shipping, California shipping. So I should make about $10. So with fees and everything, I should clear, should clear about $90, roughly in that $90 range. Pretty close to that. I'm thinking $120, uh, maybe, maybe $85, $85. All right, hey. Remember the vintage electronics, and this one is a Sony DVD VHS combo recorder both ways. VHS and CD, you can record on both. These are desirable, and especially when you, <coughs> excuse me, especially when you find it new. This guy was new, not used, but I still kind of put it through the test. I let the people know it. I let them see it. I want them to see the photographs that it is new. It sold for $349.95. $39.95 shipping so uh, really really good one I love finding these you you can find them new uh, about a year ago I sold one for $500 new so keep looking for these kind of things uh, they're like little gold nuggets out there all right to TN350 probably the most popular brother toner um, I pay anywhere from $2.99 to $4.99 that's generally kind of where you find these so these were about eight, let's call it $8 for the two of them. Sold a pair for 70, free shipping. This is going to Arizona. One thing about these guys, these ink resellers and toner resellers are very particular. They do not want an open box. It's just weird, but they will let you know it. And they also want it packaged in another box. So you've got to be prepared for both those things to happen. And like clockwork, that's what happened. Guy bought it, $70, and after the fact, he sends me a note, hey, uh, make sure it's in a double box, that they are sealed. You know, it, it's, you just gotta, you just do it enough, you know what they're after, right? And so, it's what it is. You have to deal with these guys. They're pretty much the ones who buy them. You know you can flip them for uh, anywhere from $35 to $45, depending on how much inventory is out there. All right, guys, up next, the poker chips. Here we go. These poker chips sold for $99.95 and $19.95 shipping. California shipping again. Really, really nice. These were on the video a uh, couple videos past. Sold fast. Before I can get out of my chair, basically, listing, it had sold. So I thought, first thing I thought was, oh my, did I make a mistake here? I tried to look these up. Those are very difficult to look up. I don't think I made a mistake on the price. Uh, it wasn't, you know, I think I was right within that range. So $99.95 paid $10 along with the amplifier and the pedal. Remember, we thought the pedal would pay for everything. Well, it turns out the poker chips are paying for everything. And I've had a couple offers on the pedal, but they're like too cheap right now. So anyhow, that was a really, really quick flip. That was a really good one. Keep your eye out. Remember, I, I'm telling you, for those electronics, those high-end ones, they're going to pop into your lap. You just, you know, you just haven't quite been paying a little bit of attention and uh don't be afraid to ship them go back and watch that video of me making a sh packaging it 
and it's not not as bad as you think just make sure it's nice and tight in that box all right hey guys thanks for watching uh, we will talk to you soon